guys, it's Simply Obsessed and welcome to my channel and welcome to part 10 of my Sims 4 Best Legacy Let's Play series. If you missed part 9, a link to part 9 is in the description box below along with the link to my entire Best Legacy playlist as well as the entire Parenthood playlist because the Best Legacy, the Best Family all began with the whole Parenthood playlist. So all those links are in the description box below. Check them out if you want um but yes welcome to part 10 in the last part uh we checked we caught up with uh olivia and bella and we found out that she was pregnant and engaged and that so much has happened since we last saw the best family yeah we basically got caught up and uh was here with olivia while it was a really cool sunday a nice chill sunday um but right now it is monday morning it is 6 30 and everybody's trying to get their day started paulo's in here working out a little bit he does not have work today so he He's going to be um, keeping up with Bella, making sure that she gets all her schoolwork done and all that good stuff. Uh, Olivia, she does have work today, but she will be entering, let's see. Okay, so she doesn't enter her third trimester for another four hours. So Olivia, she was debating whether or not she, should, she could take time off, um, but she doesn't really have any vacation days available. So she's been, you know, like, she took days off for doctor's appointments and all that, so she kind of used up all her time. So she has to wait until her um, parental leave kicks in. So she's going to be going to work today. Paolo's not a big fan of it. He wants her to just call out sick because she's pregnant, and that's believable. But, you know, Olivia's on her grind she's a working mama so she's going to be going to work today uh, but Paul has the day off so if anything happens he can you know uh, be there in an instant but yes so uh, Bella you're gonna need to get ready for school my dear how about you just come in here and have a quick meal eat a bowl of cereal for breakfast Olivia you all oh, you're so uncomfortable oh she has morning sickness Olivia you're gonna come in here can you throw up yeah come in here and do what you need to do handle your business pregnant mama poor thing she has to be at work at nine so we're gonna make sure that she uh oh that toilet's disgusting we really need to do something about this whole one bathroom situation um but we're gonna have you uh take a quick shower before you go to work and then grab a bite to eat bella what are you doing you're in here eating breakfast. Paulo, you just finished working out, so you're in need of a shower. Um, but come down, come not, not come down there. Come in here and clean up this toilet. Clean with some vigor. Because <laughs> that toilet is disgusting. And then use the bathroom and check in on Bella if she doesn't leave by the time you get down here. And Olivia, my sweet, how about you get some leftovers and grab a bite to eat. You know, make sure that you eat before you go over go to work and look at Bella she's just so sweet she has good manners washing her dishes oh, I love her she's spoiled but she's not rotten that is why I love her so much like she is going to be an awesome big sister oh, I just can't wait till this little bambino gets here all right Paolo you how about you just come down here and chat with your lovely beautiful pregnant and glowing fiance while she's eating breakfast before she heads off to work let's give her a little bit of love Love her up a little bit. Tell her how beautiful she looks. Oh, Aww. Feel the baby. And then send her adorable, heavily pregnant self on to work. And are you hungry, Paolo? Oh, he's not even hungry. Nope, he's not hungry. Only thing he needs to do is take a shower. So put away uh, these leftovers so they don't go bad. Oh, and give this funky puppy pancake uh, a bath. Leanna Geary. Oh, oh. No, we, we don't have time for breakfast today. It's a busy morning. Maybe another time. We yeah, help out a little bit, Paolo. Put the dishes away. Oh my goodness! Look at the little <laughs> little puffs of dirt as uh, what's this all you think? As pancake runs to use the bathroom. Look at the dust coming off of this poor dog. This poor poor dog. Oh no! What's wrong? What's wrong, puppy? We might have to run and take a pepperoni to the vet. Oh, he's a little sad. Let's give him some loving and, uh, you know, just make him feel all loved and adorable. Let's see, he really needs to go potty. <laughs> uh, not potty, for a walk. 
but it's kind of snowy out and he's really little but more important more important than a walk this dog needs a bath like you can see the dust and flies on both of these doggies oh goodness um, oh Mariko everybody wants to hang out look we're, we're it's a busy Monday morning guys <laughs> where were you all over the weekend it is a busy Monday morning so Paolo before you take a bath how about you get uh, these pepperonis clean oh and this toilet is broken all right uh, hire repair service it's a Monday <laughs> hire repair service and then give pancake and then popcorn a bath because these doggies really need it they are funking up the place and then go ahead and take care of yourself and give yourself a bath all right so he doesn't have to go back to work until tomorrow until tuesday and he's well on track to earn a promotion which is going to come in handy with the baby on the way oh bella let's have you make some friends and olivia just socialize with your coat no actually take it easy at work you're you're pregnant just take it easy um all right pepperonis uh oh a new challenge olivia needs a new challenge at work how does she ask the boss i don't want her to demand because that could be a little rude but just present some suggestions and what does it say olivia hates waiting for others to give her ideas so she presents her boss with suggestions for how she can be challenged olivia's boss appreciates the gumption gumption and praises her so it says performance gain medium twice awesome 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 so she got a performance gain and how close is she to a promotion okay she's a little way off but not too far all right paulo are you able to give these dirty doggies a bath are you? Oh, popcorn is hungry. Okay, you know what? Before we give them a bath, and while you know what, he's in there working. Repairman's in there working. So, let's call these puppies to eat. Call pancake and popcorn to eat while the repairman is in the bathroom, doing what he's doing with the toilet. <laughs> so we're not in his way. And then we'll give the little, the little pups a bath. Uh, call pet to eat popcorn. I don't know why they won't just go to the bowl themselves. I mean, there's enough food here. That's a bit annoying. Um, but yeah, okay. <laughs> I wish they'd go over to the bowls themselves and eat. But Paolo, you're a bit funky, so you need to take care of yourself and take a shower. Because, uh, yes, you, you're, a little, you're a bit funky. Oh, and Paolo is a music lover, so we need to make sure that we play some music. You can see that there are some instruments down here. These were here in the house when Olivia moved in. The previous owner was a music lover, so they kind of left some of their old instruments here. So I want Paolo to kind of learn how to play an instrument, you know, for fun. And maybe the guitar or the piano to put these uh, instruments to good use so they're not just just sitting here we gotta kind of find a way to um put these to good use and position them so they're not just you know sitting around um but you're done with your shower dude awesome okay give these dogs a bath popcorn give popcorn a bath first this day is going by so fast before you know it bella will be home from school and needing help with homework so yes it's a monday he's a dad now he's all about that dad life so he doesn't mind but go ahead and give this filthy, filthy puppy a bath. Aww. Oh, let's see this in first person. Oh, I love this. Bath time. Oh, I'm loving first person. This is so awesome. I've never given a pet a bath in first person before. This is so cute. All right. <laughs> and where's the other funky doggy? What is he doing? Just running around running around he's got a case of the zoomies look at all that dirt Ugh, poor doggy he really really needs a bath oh and this plate needs to be washed but I'll help them out put that in the sink for them and uh, Bella my dear you get out of school in an hour awesome oh and we really need to have you complete this project that you neglected to tell mom and dad was due pretty soon Paolo helped her out a little bit last night but it was getting pretty late she had to go to bed and he was so into it he was starting to take over but we have to make sure that Bella finishes her own project uh, before it's due and Paolo are you done with doggy number one awesome look at that shine oh, look at that doggy give him a nice pet um, Oh, poor baby, what's wrong? 
Oh no, don't relax and unwind. Don't go on the couch. Just give this puppy some love. What's wrong, Pepperoni? Probably needed a little bit of loving. Ask him to go potty. Alright, so time for the next Pepperoni to get a bath. Pancake, it is your turn. And just like that. Oh, is she home from school? No, she, she met somebody else at school. Alrighty, so this is going to be... Oh, she's home from school, just like that. Awesome. <laughs> Alrighty, girly, you need to boost your fun and grab a meal. How about you just grab a snack, have a quick meal, enjoy some animal crackers. Enjoy some animal crackers before you get into doing your homework. And while you're doing that, Paolo is going to be giving this dirty puppy a bath, and then he will help you with your homework. So much to do. This this household is going to be so busy uh, when the baby gets here. Um, but like I was saying, this whole area right here is going to be the nursery. This is the second bedroom slash office situation. It hasn't really been decorated since Olivia moved in. So we're going to have to figure out how to make this room look really cute and inviting for a little baby. So let me go ahead and do this right now. They haven't really gotten started, but uh, she's in her third trimester. So this baby's going to be here pretty soon so let's just do a quick little decoration we're going to move his treadmill into the hallway for now <laughs> i would love for him to have a home gym but um there's not enough space for it so we're going to have to move his treadmill into the hallway for now we can get rid of this fireplace because that's slightly dangerous <laughs> for a nursery and uh, put this gnome outside real quick on the steps there we go and can we change the color of this rug to something cute and baby-ish no okay so we're just gonna sell this rug real quick and sell this just sell everything in here to be honest and this painting and all right so let's go ahead and buy a bassinet real quick they don't want to know what the sex is they're just going to wait until the baby's born they want to be surprised so we're going to keep this whole room somewhat uh neutral and color combinations like you can use any color you want for a boy or girl but they're going to stick with greens to make it you know a little simple they got their nursery they're going to add a teddy bear Oh, and they're going to need some lights. I really love overhead lighting. So we're going to get some nice overhead lights for this baby's room. There we go. A little cute little rug, maybe, perhaps? No, I don't like that. All right. I can be really indecisive. So this is just going to work for now. And they'll go ahead and buy it. A few extra things a little later but yeah that's a nice start <laughs> that's a nice start for this nursery but you know they'll finish it eventually all right Paolo let's get a, a look at you giving this little pepperoni a bath oh, I love this first person camera it is so cute I just love it oh, when the baby is born we're definitely going to be taking advantage of that first camera a first person camera there's so much that I want to see especially when the baby ages up into a toddler oh, so excited all right Bella you're in here snacking before you get your homework done you need a little bit of fun but homework is important but clean up after yourself I want Paulo to help you with your homework but help out a little bit and clean up some of these dishes I just love how helpful Bella is like she's got good manners she's a, she's a good kid I can't wait to see how hands-on she's going to be when um, when the baby gets here oh and we've been wanting her to join the scouts but uh let's see let's see let's have her join the scouts olivia really wanted her to do that so that way she can get out the house make some friends and just keep her busy during the weekend so she's just not lounging around Alrighty, so we need to choose an after school activity for bella i was thinking about the scouts you know that's something for her to do some you know something for her to you know get badges and be a part of and make friends and be involved with the community and all that good stuff that's really what olivia wants for her but the drama cup club is looking pretty good so let's see here as a drama club member you're performing local plays and eventually hone the those fine acting skills crying on demand is useful in plays as well as getting out of things impress your classmates and parents with your ability to virtually become anyone um you know what Scouts sounded nice, 
but we're gonna have her join the drama club i think that fits bella's personality all right so she starts tuesday at 3 30 so after school okay so it's not on the weekends but that's fine scouts was on the weekends but drama club is after school during the weekdays and that's fine because if they want to do something for the weekend you know she doesn't have to miss anything she's not going to miss a meet or anything all right so that works all right my lovely olivia come in here and give your little girl some loving brighten her day you know hug her up give her some smooches be really sweet to her because <laughs> you missed your daughter you missed your little girl today ask her about school and oh ollie's calling <laughs> sorry ollie everybody wants to chat with us but we're kind of busy today olivia can call him back later yeah all right. um paulo He's finally done with taking care of the dogs. <laughs> Let's have him clean up this bathroom a little bit because Olivia will go off if that dirty uh, water is all over the place. Oh, Haley. Oh, no. And his friends are calling him. Look, people. It is a Monday after Monday evening. These two are parents. They do not have the free time to just be going different places with you all. All right. So come down here and... Uh, chats with Olivia since she just got in from work and chats with Bella since they're finally done with the dogs ask about her day at school he's a little hungry is Bella hungry not really she did have a snack and she needs to use the bathroom all right so I know you're in need of fun but homework is first use the bathroom and then get your homework done and she has another project goodness girl <laughs> she has another project oh my goodness what is it with all these projects she just got one or maybe that one's old you know what we're gonna have her finish this one first because i think we have a couple days in between projects and then we you know but in between receiving the project and then turning it in and then after we um do this one we'll go ahead and take care of this project because <laughs> that's a lot all right so once you're done in the bathroom do your homework and what is this what is this in her inventory? Oh, it's just a bowl. Okay, we'll, we'll just get rid of that. There we go. Awesome. 50 smallions. All right, my dear, you're going to do your homework. And these two... Oh, Blake, everybody's calling on a Monday evening. These people have responsibilities. <laughs> All right, so she's chatting with her love. Let's have them embrace and be romantical. And since Olivia is a little tired... And needing to use the bathroom, Paolo will fight through his hungry, hung, hungry, <laughs> his hunger to help Bella with her homework. Uh, help with homework. He was kind of caught up in making sure that those dogs weren't funking up the place with their dirty paws. Um, that he didn't really get a chance to chat with her once she got in. But let's make sure that he checks in on her and helps her with her homework. Wait, did she finish it? Oh, okay. Awesome. So he's helping her with homework. Olivia, my dear, you're tired and you, you probably need to pee because you are pregnant. <laughs> Let's have you use the bathroom and then come down here and take a little nap. I don't want you to go to bed just yet, but take a little nap down here. Oh, I could have had you. You know what? Oh, well. <laughs> I could have had her use the bathroom down here. Awesome. So her responsibility is boosted. Her homework is done. Take Change out of your clothes. You don't need to be in your outside outfit. Change it to your everyday attire. And you need some fun. You are able to play a little bit since you did your homework. Come play with your Tum Tum Teddy. And Paolo, since you finished helping her with homework, you can sit down and grab a bite to eat. Eat some leftovers. So much is happening. <laughs> this house is so busy with just one kid. Can you imagine how busy it's going to be with two? Just imagine how busy this household is going to be if they end up having twins. I do not want these two <laughs> to have twins. That's a bit much. Let's see this in first person. Oops. Oh, I'm... I'm I'm viewing Paolo in first person. Okay, this is so cool though. But I want to see this through Bella's eyes. See her playing with her toys. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. I'm going to pop open this. This is so cute. <laughs> uh, Olivia, you still napping, my dear? Yeah, she worked today. She's like in her third trimester. She had to work. She's trying to collect some coin and make sure that everything is good. So yeah, mama's tired. We're going to let her be. And she's going to be hungry when she wakes up. But we'll let her eat once she wakes up on her own. Paolo, he's in there eating. And once he's done, he'll go ahead and use the bathroom in here. 
and Olivia, not Olivia, Bella. All right, your fun is boosted. That's awesome. Come in here and finish this project that you didn't tell your parents about. <laughs> and now you have two projects back to back that are due. Make sure you turn this in, my dear. Look at her, all focused. Oh, this is so cute. All right, I'm done. <laughs> is this project almost finished? Almost. She's got a ways to go. All right, Paolo. Well, Olivia just woke up, so how about you get some leftovers? Paolo, while well, Olivia's... Oh, my goodness. What is it with the plumbing in this house? Oh, gosh. We're just going to have... We're just going to replace it. We're not even going to deal with that. All right, come in here and help her with her project. You can have some alone time with Olivia once Bella goes to sleep. Daddy duty. Daddy duty's first right now. But I love how hands-on he is with Bella. Like, look at how sweet this is. Down here helping her with her homework. Can mom help out too? Can they both assist? Oh, that is so sweet. I think they're going to be done by the time Bella, uh, Olivia, these names, <laughs> by the time Olivia finishes eating. But I love that both of them can help with the homework. Okay. Now that I know, we can have all three of them assist with this next project <laughs> that's going to be due in a couple days. So let's see. Are you almost finished? It's getting late, kiddo. It's getting late. It's getting late. Almost finished. And yes, her responsibility is boosted in the school project is done. Reach level four mental. Bella can get better moods from from play arth ah for, I'm about to say arthritic. My goodness. Bella can get better moods from play arithmetic game on a computer and can now create a health potion at a science table. Awesome, awesome. Bella finished her school project quickly. Extra credit has been awarded awesome so her school stuff is looking really good what can this do i want to see what this does activate oh she's embarrassed oh oh it's poor quality oh oh poor thing it's okay at least you did it share your insecurities with dad let him know that you're not too proud of it but you know you appreciate his help <laughs> At least you got it done on time. Awesome. And she's tired and you have to go to bed. It is a school night. We're not going to have you uh, stay up late. What is he doing? Oh, he's spraying the monster under the bed for her. How sweet. He's getting her ready for bed. Oh, goodness. This day has gone by so fast. Uh, but Bella, how about you brush your teeth before bed? And then Paolo can tuck you in. Olivia, what is she doing? Oh, she's exhausted. She's so exhausted. But she's going to be giving birth in any moment. Any moment she's going to have this baby. So let's have her come up in here. And how about she just... No, not come up there. I meant down here. How about you just sit here and watch TV for a little bit. Hopefully you two can get some alone time in. And Paolo, you can put Bella to bed. Yeah, put Bella to bed. Tuck her in, because it's late. It's a school night. <laughs> there we go. Awesome. So sweet. Okay, now come down here and try to sit and chat with your beautiful fiance. I'm going to just say wife. They're not married yet, but this is, this is his wife. Chat with your wife a little bit. Kiss her. Be all romantical. Romance flirt a little bit find got a little bit alone time Lean. olivia thank him wow. for taking care of everything <laughs> with bella today without any complaints he's just so awesome <laughs> ask about how his day went i kind of know let's have them get some woohoo in maybe you know and off the night right <laughs> He deserves it. He put in a lot of work today. He's washing puppies. He's helping with homework. He's making sure that everything is taken care of. Let's end this night off right. You know, baby's not here yet, so you got a little bit of time. And uh, how long have I been recording? Let me see. All right, I think I've been recording for almost 30 minutes. So once they are finished doing the do, <laughs> we're going to end this part off because I don't want to go too far into the next day and, you know, her go into labor. I don't want to, you know, I don't want to go too far into the next day and have so much stuff happen. And then this part ends up being uh, super duper long. Oh, she's passing out. 
Oh dear. Oh, mediocre woohoo wing. Oh, you poor baby. <laughs> or you are tired with a big belly and you're feeling kind of uncomfortable. So I can see how that really wouldn't feel so good. Um, but go to the bathroom and then get some rest. She works tomorrow. Um, so let's see. Can she go on par parental leave? Uh, yes. Not yet. Okay. Well, get some rest. After you use the bathroom, because you do have to work tomorrow. She's going to work until this baby drops. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, so once she gets in the bed, we're going to end this part right about now. All right, there we go. Pausing, because I don't want her to go into labor. Not yet. <laughs> All righty, guys, so I'm going to end this part here. It was a hectic day. My goodness, was it hectic. It feels like so much stuff was jam-packed and, you know, but we got a lot done today. Olivia went to work. She didn't really get a promotion, but then again, she took it easy at work. She is in her third trimester. She's just going to work until this baby drops. So, uh, yeah, Olivia had a good day at work today. Bella had a good day at school. She got a school project done. She got her homework done. Uh, she made some friends at school. Um, Paolo, he, you know, held down the fort at home. He was watching the dogs and just making sure that everything was taken care of. It was a busy Monday. Yeah, this episode felt like a Monday. Everybody getting into the swing of things and trying to get everything done. So, yeah, this was a busy uh uh, busy little episode. I hope that you enjoyed this part. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Share it with your friends if you think they might like it as well. And uh, yes, I'm having so much fun with getting back into the groove with this whole Best Legacy. I've missed them so I can't wait to see what the future holds. They are not going away anytime soon. And uh, yeah, I'm just having so much fun with this, guys. So before I start ramming on anymore like I always do, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this part. I hope that each and every one of you has an amazing day and I will talk to you all in my next video. Bye guys!